Hey, good morning. It's uh, Cash Magal with Cash Data Consulting LLC. Today, we're going to do a quick video on uh, Google Ads. Really a fun feature that is really not so much fun. It's the uh, how to turn off the auto ad suggestions uh, within <coughs> the campaigns. If you are struggling with that, please put some comments in there or if you need help or suggestions, uh, we would love to answer your questions. Make sure you do that in the comments below. Uh, let's keep going. Uh, and I do apologize, I have a little bit of cough going on, so uh, if I randomly <clears throat> start choking, you will know why. <coughs> By the way, what is Google Ads? Google Ads is an advertising platform, right? It's also known sometimes as PPC, which is pay-per-click. Uh, one of my former students actually calls it a slot machine, which is actually kind of true. You you know, you keep putting that coin in, and it's going to spin those ads, but the minute you, you know, stop, no more ads. But uh, regardless, if you are in a competitive market like car insurance or some of the legal services, Google Ads can really drive significant business to your company. I mean, that's just, that's true. How does it do that? It does that by providing targeted leads, right, um, to, to, the, to your website, okay? So <clears throat> for today, actually, we're going to use one of our clients. They are a state planning attorney in California. So... Um, in fact, uh, we'll pull up their website, but let me just switch to this one. I believe if I just type in estate planning, <coughs> Comina, they're kind of like by Los Angeles, but uh, let me see what happens here. So <coughs> it's right there, it's showing number two on that list, which is great. Um, so, you know, that's Tony, uh, great, uh, great company. Um, and they provide a lot of uh, state planning, like living trust, living will, power of attorney, all of the other, you know, pro probate, trust administration. Feel free to check it out. Uh, but today we're really going to focus on their, um, sorry, kind of clicking here and there. <clears throat> so we're going to kind of do a quick review of their campaigns. And really want to I want to focus on the chain history and I want to show you like every time we change something, you know, Google comes and changes. It's kind of like super annoying actually, but uh, let me log into the campaign. We manage uh, campaigns for quite a few customers. This is a, this is Google Ads Manager account. I'm going to go over here and track down uh, their account, okay? So let's, let's take a look at it. And like I said, uh, we've been, um, having this issue since like october okay so once once this pulls up i'm going to change the date to um october so uh, so if i go to campaigns right in fact it's already changed so if i go to campaigns uh you can tell up on the right top this is from october 1 to today which is february okay now once once this does this okay so we're running like i said a few campaigns for them some of them are branding some of them are like estate planning but what i want you to focus on if i go left okay let's look at this let's go to change history that's basically that's essentially you know it keeps track of all the changes you've done and we're really interested in changes to the bid the bidding um uh <clears throat> the bidding strategy uh, if you will but here's here's what's interesting i want you to kind of focus here if i go down to december 24 right here okay that's me cash manager right what did we do we changed the campaign strategy right from maximize conversions which in, in this case is not so great we changed it to maximize clicks okay so Couple days, a few days right after that, look at this. Uh, recommended auto apply, right? What did they do? <laughs> I, I love Google. They changed the strategy from maximize clicks, which is what we selected to what they think is maximize conversions, right? Okay, well, that's, that's great. That's not what I wanted. So then, of course, we were monitoring this campaign actively on December 26. You notice this? I come in again. I changed it again from maximize conversions to maximize clicks. Okay. Right after that, the next day, the OCD machine of Google Ads FN changes it back. I mean, how how annoying is that? 
they change it from again maximize clicks to maximize conversion so this is complete bs and you know it's annoying because i keep changing it and they keep coming back and change it back okay um, now in their in their defense they may think it's uh you know better for our client or it's a better strategy but that's not even the point the point is i changed the setting right and they changed it back i changed it again they change it again i mean it's it's complete uh bs if you ask me so or wtf right so how do you how do you tackle this bizarre setting of auto adjustment right it's it's called basically auto adjustment for tire law group that's our, that's the estate planning attorney let's put an end to this nonsense right so how do you do that okay let me first tell you where it is so in the left navigation you're going to have to go to settings right because remember this is at the account level so this is not at the campaign level you may have an account with five campaigns right so this is going to be at the account level then you're going to find this section called add suggestions drop down okay next you are going to select don't automatically apply suggestions and then click save and boom how do you you know how do you do this let's uh let's switch again so again i'm going to uh cancel out of that yeah i'm trying to fix your pro fix your mess clean up your mess that's what i'm trying to do so you go left on the left side right above change history you go to settings okay and under settings you will find account settings so this is very important to remember that this is at the account level okay and then when i when i do that <coughs> if this thing loads up it's not the fastest uh response today maybe i need to pay my uh wi-fi bill on time or something like that but one one when it does this okay right in the middle where it says add suggestions you notice how they're conveniently changed it to set it to auto apply 14 days after notification okay well i don't want that i want to stop this madness okay so i come down here and this is this is the problem right there automatically apply add suggestions after 14 days i'm going to check this one number two Right, and of course they're gonna tell you you don't know what you're doing. Let us let us change it. We we know what's best. You know, mother, I don't need you this time. So click save. I would even <clears throat> double check to make sure that uh, there's no there's no harm in going you know to a different setting, clicking on the account settings again, and make sure. Okay, make sure that this ad suggestions is turned off. Okay. There are some other suggestions, uh, things in here too, like auto tagging and auto other stuff. I mean, for those, I'm going to leave it as is. But that was that was a quick video. Uh, definitely make sure that this setting is turned off. They're really trying to give you suggestions, but ultimately they're trying to make more money, right? They're trying to make more money, so then you have less money, basically. Um, other than that, our um, we are based in Plano, Texas. We work with small businesses. If you need help with SEO, Google Ads, social media, video marketing, uh, please connect with us. Subscribe to the channel if you can, and then like this video. Have a good day. Take care. I hope you found the video useful. Thank you for watching it. We would love to hear from you. And if you have any questions, connect with us. The best way to do that is through our website. Here it is on the screen. You can also connect. There should be a link up there, okay? We have a blog that we regularly post uh, topics on digital marketing, also focus on small businesses. In addition, we have uh, obviously our social media, so you can connect with us on Facebook if you like. We are very active on Twitter, uh, Instagram, and then finally YouTube. That's where you're seeing our video. Uh, again, um, have a good day and we'll see you later. Bye-bye.